Hey, Cersei, look. I took the beard off. I have to shave. It gets kind of itchy. Because whenever it gets cold, you know. I mean, right now it's still itchy. I just ran the razor over it, like, a bunch of times. But kept the stash, though. There you go. You happy? <laughs> anyway. All right. Guess who's there on the review table? The review desk? I don't know. The review platform. It's Falcon. Look. Marvel's Falcon. We should get a bit closer. How about that? Yeah, see that? Titan Hero Series Falcon. This is the... I guess the cartoon version? It was an animated uh, series of this. And it shows you you could get Vision, Black Widow, Winter Soldier. Look at that. You see the warning there? It wants to focus on the stuff in the back, but not in front. Ooh, don't look, don't look. Let's see. Was it focus? Focus, damn you, focus. There you go, there you go. Look, barely focused. There we go. Let's see if we can keep that. Look, three sad onions. Why, why onions are you sad? Shout out to Stuart Ashens across the pond. Who discovered the sad onion phenomenon amongst all the toys of the world. And the pond, I mean the Atlantic Ocean. Look at this. Atencao, partes pequeñas podem ser what? Gerradas? Now recomendable para criancas menores de tres anos. Peligro de asfixia. Pueden producir piezas pequeñas. No es para niños menores de tres anos. Misa angar risque. De etufment. Uh, peut produre something. De petites pieces. Uh, can't even read that. What does it say? De Concel, the Concel, au infants de mon, de tres ans. Warning, choking hazard. Small parts may be generated, not for children under three. Includes figure, includes figurine, incluye figura, incluye figura. Each sold separate, subject to availability. Yes, I picked these up, uh, was it the last Black, Black Friday sale? No, they called it Brown Thursday now. Yes, it is now called Brown Thursday because, well, Walmart, uh, I even hear they want to take away Christmas. <laughs> they want to stay open on Christmas, which is horrible. They should close on Thanksgiving. Don't be open. Anyway, they open at 6 on Thanksgiving Day, which is Brown Thursday now. Black Friday is a totally different thing the following day. And they had these on sale, like really cheap. And there were some that were like in two packs. Anyway, this is the Falcon, one of the most skilled aerial combatants in the world. Falcon soars into battle. It's a pretty cool artwork. It is a Hasbro product. Hasbro.com Avenger, see? Marvelkids.com. Look, there's a stamp number on the box. Made in China, of course. There's the addresses for Hasbro Canada. You want to stop the video there, pause it. Take a screen capture. I recommend something like Earthen View 64. That'll help you do some screen captures. And uh, we're going to need specialist equipment here. You're still watching Cersei? Yes. Shout out to Cersei, subscriber to the channel. Hello. <laughs> anyway, look, it's the Box Cutter of Freedom. Yes, folks, the mighty Box Cutter of Freedom. Setting toys free since the beginning of this channel. Oh, yeah, you wonder what that is. Look. That's a surgical scar. In fact, I have one here on my elbow. Look. In case uh, you're wondering. Let's see. Right here. Look at that. Look how big that one is. I was thinking to get it tattooed over. Turn it into like a, a centipede. And put like a tail or a head on it. But, nah, I left it natural. Look at, this, look at that stitching that I got. What a horrible thing. Yeah, this bone actually popped out through here. So, yeah, I had to get it fixed. 
Ooh, battle wounds. All right. Let's get Falcon out of his packet. And uh, he has uh, cello tape on the sides right here. Look, right there. So slice the cello tape. Open this up right there like that. It should open. There we go. There we go. All right. Falcon will be freed from his cardboard prison. Do like a cereal box, pull that out, and then yank it open. Yes. He is coming out of cryogenic freeze. And there you go. Thumbnail. Let me see if I can adjust the light better. LED light. Save energy. Save power. Save money. Switch to LEDs. Look at that. That's a pretty cool falcon. Very nice sculpting. Good job, Hasbro. All right, what do we do here? Do we just yank these out? Yes. Yank it out. No need to cut them. Okay, the wings are out. Uh, he's got some uh, there on the sh on the elbow and the ankle. We're going to need the craft scissors of freedom. Yes, folks, the mighty craft scissors of freedom. Look, with serrated teeth, a la Rambo knife. We slit that, snip that, snip it there, and snip it there. All right, that quick. And let's get Falcon out. Falcon is out. This reminds me a lot of the G.I. Joes back in the 70s. Adventure Team. You could go to Kmart. Best products. These would be on the shelf. Well, best, not really. They have like one. And then you could get a little tick and you would write... Uh, you know, the item number and the description. And then you send it off. And then upstairs, come down a conveyor belt. And then when you pay, you go, you, you leave the cashier. And then you pick up your item over here. Uh, but, yeah, they had them upstairs. Uh, so it saved on the floor space, you know, to show the items. And then uh, you get your cool toys on the top. Now, at Kmart, they had them just stocked like, you know, like this. Kind of something like this. Maybe like that. And you would see, like, Hundreds of them, and it'd be GI Joes, but it was a coffin box. In fact, uh, basically like that box right there. You see, you see Smurfette there. This GI Joe right here, like that. That's how it looked back in the seventies. Anyway, this is sort of like a revival of twelve-inch figures with these Titan heroes. I wish Hasbro would follow the Mattel style and add more articulation. Boy, this cord doesn't really want to cooperate. We're going to have to change this. Let's see. Look, it wants to turn. We really need a new tripod. Anyway. Uh, these do not have the ball jointed shoulders. Uh, let me see. Wrist, the wrists do turn Star Wars style. Very nice. You can sit down. They actually put the joint in the right position. The modern Avengers, like the ones you get in that big pack that has um, Nebula, they move this joint forward and up. So it's kind of screwy. This one actually makes sense. See, so you can sit down. Because they did have some vehicles out. Uh, it's, a, it's a nice area. Look, he could ride like a motorcycle. Like if they made a thing. Or you could custom make a vehicle for Falcon. Look at that face. See it? Very nice face. It's on a swivel. Kind of like a ball joint. Beautiful sculpt. Anyway. Uh, I think they wanted you to use them like this. Oh, yeah. It fit just like a glove. It went in perfectly, the contours. Okay, let's try it on this one. Uh, just line it up. All right. The wings are in. In fact, I have a three and three quarter inch falcon just like this. We shall do a series on that later. I did a... What was I? What was I? Goodwill? I don't know. The other day with the girlfriend? 
I did find some pretty awesome toys. Now, I did give most of them away to shoppers there where I think were from the Valley. And they were looking for gifts for the kids. They had a huge uh, a huge box of Hot Wheels. There was like 100 Hot Wheels in there for $7.99. And then another, like a plastic bag, like for a futon or a comforter. Not a futon, a comforter. $7.99. And it had all the Hot Wheels 4x4s, like hundreds of them. And then those little the cars from the, the movie cars, the ones that have the faces, the, the eyes on the windshield. The whole thing was valued probably like really high up there because there was some cars that are pretty rare. Anyway, I told the dude in Spanish, hey, you know, you should get these because there's some valuable ones in there. And he just looked through them. And he took the whole lot, the box and the bag, and he was happy. I did find some Avengers merchandise, though. I'll do a reveal of that later. Well, there's Falcon, folks. Hope you like them. Leave a comment below. I'd love to hear from you. I'm getting to the end of the video here. And, uh, yeah, pretty neat. I would like for them to re-release this in a different color. You know, more tactical. Like uh, in the movie. I got I got the other Falcon there. The one I modified. That I didn't like the arms. They were in the wrong position. I fixed that, certainly. Anyway, I hope you all are having a wonderful day. This is Armando signing out. Have a good one. Bye-bye. And give it a video a thumbs up. Share it. Uh, we need to grow the channel. We need more people. And that way I can continue to make these videos for you. And bring them in. How's that? Good thumbnail right there. There you go. All right, guys and gals. Have a good one. Bye-bye.